Hi, this is David out here in California, longtime Republican since uh, high school days, over 40 something years, served in the military, uh, proud to serve my country. Um, since Trump has been in office, I've been just baffled about what's going on with our country, the division, uh, the disrespect to other countries of NATO and other countries in general. Um, that's not what our party, that's what our country's about. Uh, it breaks my heart uh, to see this going on and putting a division between our own people here in our own country and our allies and it's a mess. Um, disrespectful to women, disrespectful to he our war heroes. I, it's, I just don't understand how uh, people can support and condone this. And even our Republicans that are in, in, in the House, they're so, they want to win so bad. And it shouldn't be about winning. It should be about the person in, in, in doing what's right for our country. And I, I think everything is just so backwards with, oh, Republicans got to win, Democrats got to win. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. I just, my heart hurts because we're so divided. I've never seen our country in such a mess. Uh, there's no leadership. Um, it, it's disgraceful. I, I just, there's not too many words to say about this man. I truly, if I saw him walking on the street, I'd just walk right by him. I, I care less. He, he's not good at all. Um, everything he does is is about himself and, and, and the other rich people. And, and he doesn't do anything for, for the, the common good of our people. And uh, it's just, if, 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 if you're not for him, he's against you, and it's not right. He should be, he works for all Americans, and that's what the president should be doing. Any president, Democrat, Republican, should be supporting America, just not Trump supporters. Should be supporting America and making good decisions, and there's no leadership. Uh, he's a joke. He's a joke to our country. He's a joke to the Republican Party. Uh, the joke to the whole world. I, Like I said, my heart just hurts because I see what's going on and such a division between people uh, of our our country and you know I, I see these Trump supporters fly this flag and you know it's kind of like so much hate and you know you shouldn't be flying the flag for hate you should be flying the flag for uh, support of our country and uh, what's going on so I, I just wanted to speak out I was really close to jumping the party. I have not jumped the party yet. Um, I'm just, you know, I'm at awe. Uh, just, we have so many great leaders and nobody wants to step up to the plate and, and take that role on. And they let some clown um, do it. And, you know, we have a lot of people that, to me, they don't understand. And they were at loss for what was ha what has been going on. but. Uh, we should never, as a nation, um, disgrace and just disrespect other countries just because you can say it. Uh, we should be empowering. We've always been a nation to empower other countries. And um, again, it's, it's just sad. So... That's where I'm at. That's where my heart's at. Uh, I just, I know things will get better. Um, the party's got to do something. I, I can't believe these people in our party are just, you know, they're standing back and just like, taking it and accepting what's going on. I mean, it's, it's ridiculous. Come on. We're the U.S. USA, man. Um, uh, a lot of people don't understand. I just... You know, if you haven't served in the military, you, uh, it's hard for you to understand how proud you are of this country and what we represent and what the flag stands for. And uh, it just it breaks my heart to, to see uh, it be torn apart 